there has been a very major piece of research done recently in Oxford uh, by the Society for Mind and Anthropology, or Anthropology and Mind, who did a 1.9 million pounds they spent on this research. As far as I remember, there were over 60 academics involved in this research from all over the world. So this was a major piece of scientific research in the realm of human psychology and anthropology. And after many years, they concluded that the belief in God, the religious belief and the belief in afterlife is not something that is taught by our parents. It is something instinctive and natural in the human being. That in fact, the very human thought process itself is shaped by religious values. This is very significant. Because of course, this agrees with exactly what Islam has been saying. That every human being is born upon the fitra. In other words, every human being, as the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, is naturally inclined to worship God alone. And as the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, it is only our parents that make us diverge away from that natural inclination to single out God for worship and make us followers of different religions or no religion at all. So this is the nature of the human being. And it's interesting that this very extensive piece of research has confirmed that. And we all have instincts. Animals, by the way, operate on instincts. What makes the human being different from the animal is that the human being has reason. We have the ability to reason, whereas animals they rely upon instincts. And we have also what we call reflex action. So, for example, if I pick up something that is hot, mashallah, not the Quran, but something that is very hot, I don't have to think. There's no process in my brain saying, this is very hot, I must drop it. No. You do it instinctively. You drop it instinctively. This is a reflex action. This is something that is not rational. This is just something that is part of our intrinsic makeup. In order to keep on holding something hot, you have to train yourself. You have to learn to bypass your normal instinctive, which a human being can do. We can learn to bypass those reflex actions and force ourselves to hold a hot coal. This is unique to human beings. Consciousness. That ability to use our mind to override our instinctive reactions. However, this instinct is there. And the belief in God is instinctive. What is the proof? What is the proof of this? It's very interesting that one of the, what we could call the high priests of atheism, Richard Dawkins, was recently on a a TV show, and he was being interviewed, and that he was saying in this interview, you know.